I'm Nathan Strong, Executive Director at Churchill Economic Development Authority here in Fallon, Nevada, and we are kicking off Economic Development Week right here in the city of Fallon. And to give us an introduction to how the city of Fallon itself uh, supports economic development on the side of the New River Business Park here is our mayor, Ken Tedford. Sir? Hi, how are you? Uh, I'm happy to be here today with you. The city of Fallon believes strong on economic development. It was a co-founder of CETA, the Nates Group, back, way back when in, in the 19, early 1980s, about 86 and 87, and still funds it heavily with uh, Churchill County. The city of Fallon is very business friendly. Uh, it's kind of a one-stop shopping when you come into the city hall. You really deal with several business entities that the city owns. Those business entities range from electric, water, sewer, garbage, sanitation. Wow, it's busy right here. Uh, transfer station, convention center, an airport, many other of those activities. And you deal with those right there. If you need gas, you go to Southwest Gas. If you need uh, telecommunications, you, you go to CC Communications, which is owned by the county. Most everything else happens in City Hall, right in that hallway. It's very easy, very friendly to do. We're sitting in the business park, which was one of those entities that no one wanted to do. Just like electric in the city of Fallon in 1911. The city did it because no one wanted to do it. The business park, which really started in 1994, was a 10 year endeavor to finish in 2004 with Gemini our bird in the hand to try to bring business here. Build it and you will come, is what they kept telling us. So we did. We built it. Uh, a lot of the things that we try to do are very friendly, very fast, very easy. It's the local autonomy that does that. We've done a couple things in City Hall that, that is not done elsewhere. When you come in, you're going to build a house or, or even do things with your commercial establishment. You get your building permit, but you don't have to pay those fees until you're done. In a residential unit, you don't have to pay until your house is sold or until you move in. In commercial, you don't have to pay until your business uh, is remodeled and you're ready to go. That's kind of unheard of. We started doing that to try to incentivize those people who were to come here. The city of Fallon is, is trying to do some other things. We have 300 lots that are ready to go or construction ready, stubbed out to the curb. All the utilities are in, but those 300 lots are ready to be built on. So we're trying to do something called Closer Than You Think. It's 60 minutes to downtown Reno. 40 plus minutes to Trick, and we've 72 minutes to Carson. Well, maybe some of the neighborhoods in Reno are 48 minutes in the northern part to that to Trick. Uh, and so, what we're trying to do is take through advertising, through billboards, through print, through radio, through TV. trying to do that and push that as we diversify our economy. So we're welcoming those people to come here and something we're doing with economic development with Nate and the city of Fallon to step it out and try to do that. All that being said, we want to welcome you as you start this week and encourage Nate as they push economic development in the city of Fallon and whatever they do and continue to do for economic development and thank them for their efforts and his staff. So thank you once again on behalf of the City of Fallon, Nate. Appreciate it and thank you and welcome whoever sees this tape. Remember, it's closer than you think.